Yeah, thank you for joining this lesson. We're going to have a physics paper two. The KCSE 2024 examination. Remember to subscribe. Remember also to share the link so that you may invite friends to the live broadcast. Yeah, so the paper is uh, very comprehensive and I hope that you people shall cooperate throughout the paper, throughout the discussion. You can comment, you can like, you can share as you continue learning. So from the paper, we begin with number one now in section A. Figure one shows the image formed by a plane mirror when an object is placed in front of the mirror. So we can see an object, then the image formed. We can also see the plane mirror. Then the question now, apart from the image being virtual and of the same size as the object, state one other characteristic displayed in the figure. What can we conclude about the image formed by a plane mirror simply from what we can see? So from what you can see, we can see that uh, the distance from the object to the mirror is equal to the distance from where the mirror is to where the image is being formed. So through that, we can derive a property and say the image is as far as far from the mirror as far behind the mirror let's see behind the mirror behind the mirror behind so let me fix the the screen yeah behind the mirror as the object is as the object is the mirror in front of the mirror so that is uh, the first property that we can notice remember the properties are many we can still see that uh, if this is uh, the left and this is the right, that is for the object, we can see that for the image, whatever was right now is here on the left and whatever was the left now is here on the right. So from this, we can say that uh, the image is laterally inverted. The image is laterally inverted laterally inverted inverted yeah lateral inversion that is what we call such a property among many other properties that uh, we can derive we can also see that uh, yeah it is virtue you can see that it is virtue Number two, <clears throat> a student observed that when removing a polyester sweater, a cracking sound was produced. Explain this observation. This is because during the removing, the friction between the sweater and the body produced what we call electrostatic charges. So electrostatic charges 
electrostatic charges are produced on the sweater on the sweater due to friction so during the removing there is some friction that friction leads to electrostatic charges being produced now the charges in the air the charges in the air discharge the charges in the sweater producing the sound producing producing the sound so the cracking sound is due to the discharge which is happening explain what happens to the potential difference of a charged parallel plate capacitor when the distance of separation between the plates is reduced so we usually say that the potential difference decreases potential difference decreases the potential difference decreases we should recall that reducing the distance of separation reducing the distance of separation reducing the distance of separation increases increases the capacitance increases the capacitance and you should recall that a uh, capacitance is usually given by q out of v because charge is given by cv then the capacitance c is given by charge q out of v from this equation it's good for us to notice that uh capacitance and potential difference are inversely proportional so since the charge is constant the charge is constant then increase in the capacitance increase in the capacitance leads to a decrease in the potential difference in the voltage or other potential difference as we continue covering our lessons i should bring to your attention our airtime program whereby you just go to the mpesa leap an mpesa option the pay bill number is a uh, 73 73 then the account number is the phone number that you'd like to purchase airtime for after that you proceed with the transaction and your airtime is going to reflect instantly so please uh, try our procedure here use this for any network be it safaricom telcom airtel you're going to get the airtime thank you we proceed with a uh, number four state one advantage of using a circuit breaker instead of a fuse in a domestic wiring system both can be used to safeguard appliances from excess currents that is electric currents but a circuit breaker has some advantages over the fuse and one of the advantages is that the circuit breaker can be reset for use the circuit breaker can be 
reset for use can be reset for use while the fuse must be replaced 